Hi guys, no idea whether this will work or not, just thought I'd try a different approach to my charity shop gold or garbage. We're currently sitting in a car park at Ashton Court, which is on the outskirts of Bristol. Uh, my wife is actually at the local pub, public house, restaurant, with a couple of her sisters. They're having coffee. It's a ladies' night. So I'm sitting in the car, in a car park. And this is my charity shop haul for today. We've been to Nailsy. Uh, nothing exciting. Got a random remote control. Twenty seven megahertz. Light doesn't come on, so no doubt it needs batteries. But it was in the cheap box, so I always like to buy any transmitters I can find. They're always handy. In the, in the same box was this little radio control car, but I don't think they're related at all. Uh, I can't even read what that says. That was my mobile phone just then. Let's have a check, see what we got. Nothing important there. Okay, back to this thing. I think I've got some glasses somewhere. May have to edit this a bit. Travelling glasses. A U E L D E V or D E Y. It's got a little socket on the bottom there, so you charge it. I expect it's got a LiPo battery in there. Says 3.7 volts. The little centering pin is missing. So it's got a nice little motor and gearbox. So we'll try that. Nothing on there that says what frequency it is. At first glance, I thought it was infrared, but there is actually an aerial lead coming up the back here. So we'll try that sometime. Just check whether that had anything written on it. There's actually a logo on it which is a couple of crescent moons and a couple of stars. So if anybody knows what that is the logo for. Right, next, <laughs> Rubik's Cube, 50 pence. Oh, those two were 50 pence each. That's 50 pence. My grandson's got into these all of a sudden. So I thought, nice little one, he could have that in his pocket to practice. Right, this. I'm pretty sure I saw Jag Betty trying one out in a shop somewhere. You have to try and get the ball into the hoop and it actually makes sound effects if you do it. I don't know if I can do this backwards while you're looking at it. <laughs> oh, 
went through and didn't go off that time. Spent a pound on that. But I think that'll keep my grandsons occupied for a few seconds. What does it say on it? Magic Sport. Made in China. Produced for Zebra. Tigerstores.com. Model number 170124. so easy doing it backwards. Yeah. That'll do. And then finally, I can't really demonstrate this one in here, but it's a rowing boat. It's missing his oars, so I'll have to see if I can make some. In fact, that side of his row lock is broken off. But, and I paid £1.99 for it, a crazy price. But it's one of those um, little bump and go things. So it goes forward till it hits an obstruction and then that turns round and he just sort of goes around. So I want to try that one out. Uh, 2006 Zizzle. Z-I-Z-Z-L-E. Or I suppose if you're American, Z-I-Z-Z-L-E. Copyright Disney. All right reserved. Made in China. To prevent entanglement, keep hair away from wheels. It has got batteries in it. I don't think we can quite show it here. <laughs> but it appears to work. It works on the shop counter anyway. So that's today's haul. £1.99. Uh, can't remember what charity shop that was. That was something to do with homeless people. That one was Break Charity. <sighs> Cancer and Leukemia in Children. Oh, I don't remember. Didn't get a receipt for that either. Um, I think that was Cat's Protection or something like that. Anyway. No doubt there'll be separate videos when I actually get those bits working, the radio control stuff. So thank you for watching. And we'll see whether the sound recording's any good on this when I come to edit it. Hey, thanks for watching. There's plenty of videos on my main channel with more added daily, so don't forget to subscribe and enable the notifications to keep you up to date with my new releases. My second channel, Grandad's Other Channel, is where I put the longer videos with more detail. Then there's my Facebook page and you can follow me on Twitter. You can help keep my channel running by donating a dollar on Patreon to buy me coffee. And if you fancy some Grandad merchandise, I have two shops, one on Redbubble and the other on Cotton Car. Finally, you can always find more information in the video description. Thanks again for watching.